Hi golfers. How about learning a new skill? A skill that you've probably been meaning to do for most of your golfing life, but never quite got around to it. The art of bouncing the ball on the club face. So how do we do it? The best starting point is to hold the ball above the club face and feel that you're dropping the ball onto the club face and feeling that you're getting the response as the ball comes up. So the ball, when it comes off the, the sweet spot, bounces slightly higher. And when it comes off the, the peripheral of the sweet spot, it feels slightly dead and bounces lower. So your skill now is to adapt to that, that ball response and feel where the club face needs to be maneuvered to get the next bounce upwards. So it's pretty cool to be able to do the ball bouncing. But it's got a benefit. When you're playing chip shots around the green, the feel of the ball coming off, off the face itself is so vital to be able to gauge distance and to anticipate what's happening. So when you understand how the ball responds to a sweet shot versus a slightly miss hit, which sometimes if you're playing out of, out of rough or longer grass, that's what's inevitably gonna happen, you've got a much better understanding about how the ball responds to that maneuver. So, stage one. So club above the, above the ball, dropping it and responding with the club face. It is the hands that actually get the ball to bounce upwards. It's the feeling that the ball itself is being propelled upwards with a hand movement itself there. You can see my hand here, there, is the movement that's taking the ball upwards. Best of luck. A little bit of time invested in that and, and, and working at it. Once we've got that in place, we'll then go to the next level.